Can you see through the gap of my teeth okay? Mm -hmm. That's how I get the wine in, you know. <laughs> Hi, my name's Rob Lehner, certified sommelier here at Sal's Beverage World. And I'm tasting the Mariano Lacorte Rioja de Reserva. This is a 2011 vintage. Now by law, the reservas have to be held at the winery for three years. Minimum of one year in oak, two years in the bottle before release. But there's no law that says they can hold them longer. So this wine was held for a few more years. It's totally up to the winemaker when he releases the wine. So this wine has some nice age on it. I would suggest that when you do uh, open this wine, that you let it open up, either decant it or put it in your glass, let it, let it open up a little bit. It's been, it's eight years old and it needs a little time to open up. But you can see in the glass, this beautiful color. Um, it's a garnet, but it almost has a little bit of that um, rusty look. Um, it, it shows the age. You can see the age in the, in the glass. On the nose, it's very enticing. It's uh, almost like cooked uh, cherry with a little sage tobacco. The, the oak is there just in the background. It's just a beautiful, beautiful nose. On the palate, the cherry comes through really nice, strong, with some very firm tannins, but not overpowering. This wine definitely needs food. Um, boy, on the finish, you get this acidity that kind of makes your mouth water. You, you, add, you add a grilled steak to this wine and you're gonna have a wonderful evening, I can guarantee it. So, uh, the Mariano Lacorte Rioja Reserva 2011. Um, a nice thing to know too is that Sal's Beverage World is the only place you can find the Lacorte Riojas in all of Chicagoland. So come on down, the Rioja by Lacorte, the Reserva, it's elegant, it's delicious, it's food worthy, and you'll have a wonderful evening with it. I have in the past already. <laughs>